hello everyone welcome to my channel today i'm going to be sharing with you three different ways i like to use rosemary for hair health and beauty let's get into it so i have my rosemary plants with me and right now we're gonna go ahead and make um a rosemary tea for the air rings so um once I put in the amount of rosemary that I want in the kettle, I will add um, a bowl of water to it. Usually, depending on how much rosemary I have, will determine how much water I add to it. Or, depending on how much potent I want the rosemary tea to be, will determine how much water I add to it. So, I'm going to go ahead and bring that to a boil for about 10 to 15 minutes. And you would see the color changes. You see the color change and once that changes i literally just left the tea to sit still when i was ready for it to be strained out so for this particular tea i'm going to be using it for two purposes which is my um air rinse after i shampoo and deep condition my hair i'm actually not even going to wash off the rosemary water so after i shampoo after i deep condition my hair i'm going to use the hair rinse for my hair and the second purpose for this particular rosemary tea is for um my daily spray usually i just put it in the um in the fridge once yeah once i'm done using it, using it every day so this is me just prepping my short 4c minute twist you guys when i tell you that this rosemary water works oh my goodness like you see my hair now right i do a struggle ponytail but within a week my pony <laughs> my ponytail is no longer struggling like you know it still is is better but i i wish i took i have clips of like my before and after i'll try to find um i'll try to find clips of it and maybe do a separate video on how i've been able to grow my hair slightly but this rosemary water works like also i'm also trying to grow my edges in that area because i did um i did a sew and i think the, the glue the glue chopped off my edges so hopefully um it the rosemary water actually works faster than faster than yeah i i hope <laughs> just giving my head a massage and yeah the second way i like to use rosemary is rosemary tea oh my goodness there are so many benefits to rosemary tea but my personal favorite is inflammation like rosemary tea is anti-inflammatory and usually when i'm stressed i just have a little bit just even just a tiny little bit of rosemary tea is typically enough to just bring me back to my usual self so i just went ahead to rinse the rosemary leaves and put it in the strainer and then add some just a little bit of water to it usually i don't i don't like much just a little bit of water to it and but this one i actually don't let it stay for too long just about five to ten minutes and once i just see the slight water change that's usually enough for me at this point you can add a sweetener if you want you can add honey or sugar yeah a sweetener basically but typically i just like to um drink mine like that The third way I like to use rosemary is in facial steaming. Rosemary itself, in facial, while steaming your face, does not directly have an effect on your face. It's more of aromatherapy. Although facial steaming um, directly affects your face, and one of my favorite benefits of steaming, uh, of facial steaming, is that it helps to open up your pores and it just feels cleaner. And one of the second one that I like is that. It helps the products that I layer, I put on my face to absorb better. So those are my favorite ways I like to use rosemary. And let me know yours. And I will see you in my next video. Bye.